Good afternoon, everybody. We are uh, delighted and honored uh, to have with us uh, His Excellency the Italian Ambassador, uh, a good friend, and a great ambassador. And we are here to witness uh, the, uh, the signature of an agreement Every year we, we expand the scope of our cooperation and that's the way to success. We are very ambitious but we do it in stages and today is a further uh, step in that direction. We are very happy that uh, we have with us our maestro for, for tomorrow Yes, and we're looking forward to a great uh, performance. I am specially honored that after tomorrow I will be leaving to Rome to address the Italian Senate. The Italian Senate is the father of all Senates, although I am a senator in, this, in, the, in the Jordanian Senate, a young country and a young Senate, but uh, the father and mother of all senates of the world is the Italian Senate. We have learned the, the, the democratic value of having a Senate from Italy. So I, I will be there tomorrow, uh, after tomorrow as, uh, as they called me, a guest of honor, a guest of honor of the, of the Italian Senate. So I'm very, I feel very, very proud and I feel very honored. Uh, for this great uh, distinction. Uh, when we speak of Italy, we speak of culture, civilization, history, music, art of all its kinds, and everything that is good. Uh, we are very proud of, uh, of this uh, relationship. That's why, because I I am involved in many, personally, and my organization in many intellectual and in many uh, artistic projects. And Italy has been a great help from the beginning. Italy is our partner in our Petra project, together with UNESCO. Uh, Italy is our partner in many uh, other events, and I will be holding an, our uh, annual meeting for our, our uh, clients in Europe in, uh, in Italy as well this year. In Verona, on the side of the uh, concurrently or back to back with the, with the Verona festival. So Italy has a special place and a special heart, a special place and a special respect in our heart. In addition to that, what the agreement we're going to sign includes something which is very interesting. Uh, we, uh, we will be producing a, a guide or a list of the words in Italian, Italian and in Arabic that have the same meaning. This is a very interesting uh, initiative that shows uh, the common the common uh, partnership between our language and the Italian language. Uh, a great language, as I always say, the most beautiful language in the world. Italian is music. When you speak Italian, it's like you're singing. And that's the only language in the world <laughs> that when you speak it, you hear music. <laughs> and uh, and it's, uh, it's so beautiful. Uh, so I, I would like to to say that we also will be hosting um, a, an office uh, for a representative for archaeological uh, research in Jordan for the embassy. And also, we will be having a joint program with Talal Abu Ghazali FM station. I am sure you are all listening to TAG, M, to TAG BC Talal Abu Ghazali Business and Culture, which is on uh, 102 102 7.
or 0 0.7 FM. 102.7, you will hear classical music for the first time in Jordan all day and night, 24 hours. I, I, uh, and of course, a lot of that music is, is the creation of the great uh, Italian geniuses. So we, we are very proud that we are uh, working closely. We will be also developing joint programs on this station with the embassy, including uh, uh, teaching, even teaching cooking, Italian cooking. And, I, and who doesn't like Italian cuisine? I don't think there is anybody in the world who doesn't love Italian cuisine. So uh, uh, it, it's many things, and uh, we have circulated a press release for you summarizing what uh, this agreement is about. I repeat that I am honored to be here today to sign this agreement with His Excellency Giovanni Proazzi, my good friend. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much, Your Excellency, Maestro Cardi. Uh, I'm uh, delighted to be here tonight, to this afternoon, uh, to sign a memorandum of understanding with the uh, Talala Bugazal organization and to launch the tomorrow concert, which is the second big concert of uh, that we have uh, or that the embassy have organized together with uh, uh, with uh, the Jordanian orchestra and basically with his uh, great patron uh, Talala Bugazal. But I want to pay tribute to the lady who made possible it, Absolutely. who is uh, now with us. Sararella and uh, her colleague uh, Russia, who made possible to uh, transform ideas, wishes into realities, into facts. It is very, I learned how difficult it is because out of 10 ideas, you, uh, you should be satisfied if you accomplish two of them. And I think working with Talala Bugazal, the rate is much higher. So I'm extremely pleased of this uh, collaboration, which extends from music to archaeology, to radio, to uh, uh, lessons of cooking and whatever you name them. Uh, the idea of launching uh, uh, of uh, working, to, uh, working with Italian partners to create a collecting society in the Arab countries is a great idea. And I'm glad that this will be discussed at the Italian Senate in two days' time. You're lucky you are going there in the middle of, Ma of uh, May, because I would have warned you not to go in the middle of March. Oh. You know Beware why? the heights of March. Yeah, <laughs> so it's a, it could be a quite dangerous <laughs> place. But we have moved it. We have shifted it of uh, roughly two kilometers. So okay. now it's in a safer area. Uh, and uh, I, I'm sure it will be a very important meeting with uh, a, a lot of uh, good ideas uh, for the future of this uh, region, a region that is to which Italy does not belong geographically and historically, but we are very close neighbor, and the interaction between Italy and the Middle East, uh, I mean, is long-standing, is very important, and uh, I think there are a lot of affinities, there are a lot of uh, important things we share, important values we share. So the meeting of the minds is very easy, especially when you have, when your interlocutor is a volcano of ideas, of initiative, 
who is not resting uh, ever, is always uh, uh, proposing something new, uh, uh, exploring new avenues. And this is, uh, I think, is very refreshing, very important uh, for a, a, an embassy to find here locally an interlocutor who has a world vision, but who has also is very attached to traditions and is very open uh, to dialogue. is extremely uh, important, and the, uh, the association, the collaboration with uh, an entity like the Talala Bugazal organization has also this added value. We generally, the embassy, we work with governments, with public entities, and from time to time we lack the tempo, the dynamism that is given by the private sector. Here we have the private sector that is very best, because it's a private sector that has not only, let's say, is not led by greed or by, uh, let's say, selfishness, but is a private sector that uh, want to share uh, values, experiences, uh, want to open uh, new avenues. And this is extremely important. It was a great Italian tradition in the past, where what we uh, call from the Greek, uh, from our Greek uh, origins, mecenati. I think you are one of the last mecenati of the present world. And I salute you for the role you are playing uh, in, uh, in favor of uh, art, culture, of uh, dialogue, uh, without, uh, let's say, a selfish agenda, but with uh, broad goals uh, and uh, uh, important uh, Initiative. So for us, it's a great honor to be your partner in the very in the number of initiatives we have highlighted, and hopefully in the future to expand it further, because I think Italy and Jordan, which are I would say relatively poor countries in terms of physical resources, in terms of uh, uh, geographical constraints, have a great asset in their human resources. And you are at the very best in, uh, let's say, uh, helping human resources to develop, uh, not only in the artistic uh, field, but also in the intellectual property. So ideas, knowledge is always at the basis of, uh, uh, of whatever you, you are embarking. So this is extremely important, and uh, we are proud to be your partner. Having said that, once again, uh, thank you very much. Uh, I look forward to the concert tomorrow by one of the most renowned uh, uh, Italian uh, uh, orchestra director. It will be a great night tomorrow. I advised a Minister of State for Education who was supposed to arrive tomorrow night, late in the evening, to attend the day after the Sesame, uh, the Sesame uh, opening, uh, the opening of the Sesame Center uh, near Salt. He will come tonight, the day before, in order to attend tomorrow the uh, the concert. So we will have a concert where Italy will, re will re be represented at the governmental level. And this is, I think, is the least we can do to pay tribute uh, to a great man uh, who had the, 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 the fortune to consider my good friend. Thank you very much, and Mabruk. Thank you. I just want to, I just want to repeat for our friends, uh, our distinguished participants, uh, and colleagues who, who came a bit late, we are here to witness uh, the signature of an agreement between uh, the Embassy of Italy and uh, the Talal Bazale organization. And as His Excellency said, this is a, a unique uh, honor, honor because uh, embassies usually work with governments. We realize that this exception is uh, a great privilege and we are proud of that, but we will 
always try to be worthy of your confidence and to honor the, the agreement. Uh, as I said, uh, this agreement includes uh, more cooperation. We were we started in the beginning with uh, another with our first performance with musical performance with uh, the embassy. Now we have one tomorrow. But in addition to that, we have many other things that we will be doing together, as you see from the press release. And uh, as I said, I, I want to thank you again for the invitation that I received to be uh, the guest of honor of the Italian Senate uh, on the 17th, two days uh, from now, on Wednesday. On Wednesday, I uh, will be speaking at the Senate and I feel very, very honored, very proud that uh, such a, a place, the leading Senate of the world, is hosting my humble person uh, for a speech. But that is uh, something I will always uh, be, feel proud of. In um, addition to that, I, as I said, uh, we will be doing many things and we promise you that in a, next, in, a next, in a future meeting, we will have more to tell you. We will go step by step and do more things uh, uh, as we go. I want to add to your uh, statement about our most able director, Sarah, Sarah Rella, who is Italian also, the director of the George Jordan Orchestra is Italian, and we're very proud that she's Italian. And uh, she has been with me from the beginning in reviving and launching the Jordan Orchestra. And she has been my very most uh, useful right hand. I counted on her, and she supported uh, everything I wanted to do. And we work as a good team. And, uh, also, we, luckily, we have her assistant, who is also half Italian, Russia. She, she's, uh, so we are influenced by the Italian culture, uh, de facto. There is, no, there is no way out. We have to, to recognize that we are uh, very much impressed by the Italian culture. And uh, the, the fact is uh, we are all very, very proud uh, of being uh, related to the uh, Italian uh, embassy. I welcome your colleagues from the embassy who are who are with us uh, today and uh, who are sharing with us this occasion. And before I ask you to kindly sign, I would like our maestro if ask him if he would like to say a few words. Yes. Thank you. <coughs> Uh, I would uh, to thank uh, the uh, is uh, essentially uh, Abu Ghazal, a uh, wonderful person, and uh, the ambassador, uh, Italian ambassador Giovanni Brunzi for this uh, wonderful uh, welcome. Uh, and I, I would like, uh, I would to thank uh, Sara Renda, who was the, the first person that I contacted they contact me and uh, the, uh, uh, Antonella Berardinucci and Maestro Mohamed Siddiq uh, is not here but uh, uh, it was very collaborative uh, and uh, the orchestra uh, I am uh, the joy to conduct uh, for the first time this orchestra uh, they are very collaborative, very friendly, uh, and uh, uh, day after day uh, um, uh, they improve uh, because the program uh, is popular but uh, is, uh, uh, is not easy. Uh, the fifth of Beethoven is uh, very strong, uh, and I. Um, there is uh, the the string, uh, the string of the orchestra are very very heavy, uh, very uh, incredible sound, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, sometimes I stopped because they <laughs> they, they play so, <laughs> so loud. <laughs> and, uh, um, uh, 
we love strong yes, uh, strong strong views. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> the program is half Italian uh, with the the beginning is this uh, uh, Verdi uh, preludio da Traviata <clears throat> and uh, the second piece is uh, strange for me but uh, very uh, fascinating uh, because uh, is uh, uh, the adagio of Albinoni, Albinoni's adagio, uh, sing, uh, sing by, by uh, um, uh, in Arabic uh, song with uh, ma many uh, many notes, many Arabic. Uh, uh, how would you say? You know, uh, improvisation uh, uh, is a, a very nice, a very very. Um, Good uh, singer, uh, singer, uh, singer <coughs> that uh, very young singer that uh, uh, sing this uh, adagio of Albinoni in this uh, uh, exotic for us uh, of West for us uh, music. And uh, then uh, there is a, a piece of uh, Giovanni Sgambati. Giovanni Sgambati uh, is uh, the most important symphonist in Italy. Uh, the, the, uh, the Italy is known in the world for the opera, but uh, uh, the, there are many symphon symphonic composers, uh, and Giovanni Sgambati was, was a uh, pupil of Franz Liszt in Rome, and they composed a symphony, important symphonies. Uh, we, um, um, we, um, the, the third piece of, uh, is a serenade, a serenade from the first symphony of Giovannis Gambati. I uh, reconstructed the second symphony, it was lost, uh, this symphony. I uh, reconstructed this symph the second symphony of Giovannis Gambati, it's a, a, a wonderful symphony. And uh, I uh, edited this, uh, and I conducted this uh, with Milano Ver La Verdi Orchestra. And I, uh, there is this uh, a, uh, record that uh, I give. Uh, uh, His Excellency, thank you, uh, Ambassador. Is, uh, there is uh, an interview about this period. It's in Italian, but it's. Uh, um, then yeah, after Scambati, uh, Rossini, La Gazzaladra, uh, the famous uh, overture, and then uh, Beethoven, Field. Uh, with my wife, Elisa, uh, uh, we are uh, guest of a, a friend of mine, uh, Dr. Alessio uh, Ponce de Leon, uh, that, uh, who works, uh, works here in Amman uh, for uh, many, day, many years. Uh, how, how long are you stay here? Almost four. Four, four. <laughs> and uh, I uh, met again after, I think, 20 years. Uh, yes. Very long time. <laughs> and we are guests in a, a beautiful, a wonderful Arctic, uh, over the, the city where the, we can uh, uh, look at this uh, wonderful uh, view uh, uh, in the night, uh, in particular, the fantastic, yes. Um, then, thank you very much for the, uh, your uh, hospitality. Thank you very much. Yes, I, I hope this is the first of the project. Of the project. Uh, I hope sometimes if you have a because uh, um, the, the orchestra um, uh, is, uh, is very very good for uh, for Italian repertoire, but for Beethoven, uh, the, the strong of Beethoven, strongness of Beethoven uh, is uh, is uh, um, very close to this orchestra. I hope sometimes if you have a, a good choir, uh, we can go, uh, we, we can conduct uh, the ninth symphony of Beethoven. <laughs> Well, thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Needless, needless to say, I feel very proud sitting between two Giovannis. And, uh, uh, I, Francesco. <laughs> Francesco. No, Giovanni Scambati is the composer. The composer, composer? is Giovanni. Oh, okay. Giovanni. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's a Roman. It's a Roman. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Ah, so, anyway, uh, this is a great privilege and a great honor. And uh, I thank you for being with us. Yes. The idea of your being here is because we want to improve the quality of our uh, orchestra. Yes. 
this this is uh, this training that you are giving them is very valuable, and this will improve uh, their skills, and that's why we are very grateful to you for spending the time yes. to rehearse yes. with them. Thank you very much. Thank you to you. I would like to call on Your Excellency to sign the agreement, the memorandum. and grateful to you for your support. Thank you. And any questions from the our friends here? There are, <clears throat> there are two musicians, uh, yeah. Italian musicians in the orchestra, mm -hmm. and, uh, Luca and Francesco. They play the principal yes. flute and the principal French horn. French horn. Yes, so. uh, so. Francesco Di Siato uh, and uh, Luca مستمره <تصفيق> There are no questions. Maybe we'll take a photo, group photo with your excellency and with our Italian friends and the Jordanian yes. friends as well.